Hey, what's up, YouTube? Leo Sheng here, host of the Extreme Full Efficient channel. <laughs> Today is April 11, 2017, my 34th outing of the year, I believe. Let me just double check, you know, because I don't want to alienate you guys when it comes to that, right? This is actually very important to me. Oh, it is my 36th outing of the year, okay? I'm down here in Atlantic City, New Jersey, at Epsicon Inlet. Beautiful day out here, between 50 to 60 degrees Fahrenheit. The water is still a little bit cold, you know, but overall it is a beautiful, beautiful morning. My family decided to come to AC, you know, do a little vacation. And as always, Leo Shang, you know, just decided to sneak out, right? At the first opportunity, you know, I don't have a lot of time to fish here today. Only three hours. And I mean, we'll try to catch whatever bites in three hours, you know? Togging has been really hot down here, right? I mean, April season, I think it's like four tog at 15 inches. So we may do some togging today, but my main target for today is really to catch two things. One is a clear nose skate, all right? Because recently on my Smug Mug Fish Photo Database, I found out that most of the photos of clear nose skate that I have are actually photos of little skate, which is another species of fish. That's why I increased my species count by one, right? From 166 to 167. So I don't have enough photos of clear nose skate. I would be very, very happy if I caught one today. And the second thing that I really want to catch today that nobody likes to catch, it is the spiny dogfish, okay? It's a type of little shark, a fake shark, you know? And uh, I've caught plenty of dusky smooth hound. I have never caught a spiny dogfish. Hopefully today is gotta be the day, you know, that I will be able to add that to my species list, okay? So stay tuned, fellas. I'm here with my good uh, brother-in-law. He's ready to do some fishing with two rods. I got one rod in the water, you know, and we will see what we can catch. Hopefully something good. That was a little bite. But uh, why only two bites, though? Maybe my hook too big? I don't know, I saw two bites. <laughs> and then, that's it. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Come on, take it, dude. <laughs> Come on, whatever you are. What the heck? Oh, oh, yeah, that was a bite for sure, dude. I think I got something on. Yeah, I think so. Guys, I think the first fish of the day is coming up. I did see three, four bites. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's on. I think it's a skate or something like that. Yeah, look at that. It's a skate. It's a skate. Yeah. First fish of the day is a skate coming up. Look at that, huh? Bit on the clam. Now let's see what type of skate we got here because uh, I'm running out on photos on the clear nose skate. Damn, I'm using a big ass hook, man. Look at that, I'm using like a two, a two, uh, a one off hook. And this little skate just got it like that. This is a little skate, by the way. Uh, recently on my Smug Mug Fish Photo Database, right? I kind of uh, realized that a lot of the skates that I caught were not clear nose skate but actually little skate and this is actually a little skate okay this is not a clear nose although it does kind of have a clear nose okay but from the dots above you can clearly see this is not a clear nose skate okay let me take a shot at this guy here it is a uh, one little ugly <laughs> creature from this angle all right but they are very they are very fun okay so let me just uh, unhook and take a photo and we'll see what we do with him if you sure skate What is that? Is that a skate? The the little shark. Oh yeah, it's the little shark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the little dogfish, right? Like I told you, be careful, okay? If it is a spiny dogfish, just be careful with it, okay? Hey, yeah, I mean, good stuff, right? Let me see. Got to be careful with this oh, guy. Yeah. All right, let's let's be careful with this dude. All right. 
Could you please handle that? Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't worry. Wait, wait. Just that. Yeah, this is a spiny one. This is a spiny. This is a spiny one. You see how there's two? Yeah, yeah, there's yeah. one right here and one right there. All right. So I don't want to touch that thing too much. Let me handle my my my. Let me handle my thing first, okay? But yeah, this is a spiny. This is a spiny dogfish right here. Oh, okay, the good size. All right, guys. So uh, first fish of the day. This little this little skate just does not want to let my hand go. All right, it is a wonderful creature. Just doesn't look very good when it is in this position, okay? No danger in handling him, all right, whatsoever. A little bit spiky on top, but other than that, you know, it's a nice little fellow. We're gonna throw this guy back right here uh, as good as possible without hurting myself and the fish, all right? So, boom, there he goes. Yeah, you see, you can't even see no more. Now we go take care of the spiny dogfish that my brother-in-law caught. Gonna handle it with super care right here. Let me get my pliers. Just gotta be very careful with this one right here. You see this pine right here, guys? Just gotta be very careful with this pine and the one that my brother-in-law is tapping there. So let me just uh, unhook this guy real quick. Oh, you see that, dude? Okay, <laughs> easy little shark. All right, he's out, he's out, just dude. Okay, I just be careful with the spines, all right? Don't don't let it do you like the bluefish did, okay, dude? It's not the best, but it is what I can do, okay? Just throw it. Yeah, just throw throw it in, dude. Throw it in. Be careful with the spikes, dude. It's ironic because Yeah, he's good to go. Yeah, 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 he's back. He's back. Good job, dude. Good job. It's quite ironic because that is the species that one of the species that I'm looking for today. I have caught the dusky smooth hound, with a tar which is a type of little shark, but I never caught a spiny dogfish yet, which is the one that you guys just saw. So, you know, the quest continues. Let's see what else we can land today. Is there anything on or is just your, your sinker? Just grass. Why there's look, looks like there's something on it, dude? Yeah, dude. I told you, man. It looked like there's something on it. You know, when you were saying grass, grass, that is skate. That's how skates are, dude. You don't feel crap, only weight. That's a little skate. Yeah, the same one that I caught just now. Yeah, same type. You can see just by the dots and the and the stuff on its body, you know? Not a clear nose. Just another little weirdo. Look, look at that, man. Pretty sketchy, pretty sketchy fish for sure. All right, guys, we just got to release this little skate right here. You know, I don't want him to do my brother-in-law like the bluefish did. I just wanted to show you guys how beautiful the eyes of the little skate are. Check that out, huh? It is truly a uh, kind of weird, but at the same time, gorgeous species of fish okay when it opens up check this out it doesn't want to open up right now but when it opens up right this is pretty much the format right so you know nothing to be scared about it's a nice little friendly guy right you got to be careful with the rays because the rays always have you know the pointy side at the end here that can hurt you really bad right and get you to the hospital but skates is like a whole different story look at that huh good to go good to go so guys, check this out. Huh? This is this is the secret right here, okay? <laughs> this is the secret bait. All right, tell us how long we have had this pack of clams right here. Probably over a year. Over a year in the freezer, all right? <laughs> we take this out maybe two or three times. Cannot never finish it. Yeah, can never <laughs> finish it. And caught all the fish today. That's for you to see uh, the sturdiness of the salty clam, all right? Tide is kind of going down right now. Let me use this opportunity that the action kind of slows down a little bit to actually show you guys the setup that we're using for today. At least the setup that I am using for today. Very simple setup as you guys can see, right? I, I leave everything in the description of the video. I'm using a one notch hook with just a gigantic piece of salted clam with a three ounce pyramid sinker, right? It is easy just like that. And you know, the goal for the day, like I said, was really for us to, you know, try to catch some um, some clear nose skate and some dogfish. 
So, so far things have been going good. Action slowed down in the last one hour or so. So my brother-in-law and I, we came here right at the right moment, you know. Hopefully we'll land some more fish. Stay tuned, fellas. Yeah, got a bite here. Probably a skate or something. What the hell? Oh, it's, it's, it's one with it, man. It's one with it. Oh yeah, it's on. Oh yeah, man. Let's hope it's a dogfish, because I really want one. Oh, crap. Yeah, it's, it's either a skate or a ray, dude. Yeah, it is definitely one of those. Either one or another. Oh, it's a dogfish, dude. Oh, it is. Oh, dude, that may be my first one. Now, look. People can say that this is a trash fish all they want, you know? But for me, if this is a spiny one, glory for extreme food fishing. Got to handle this guy with some care here. All right, guys, we got a little dogfish right here. We just got to do the old flip. And if he goes, he goes. If he doesn't, if he doesn't, you know, got to be very, these guys are very feisty. That's for sure. Don't want to risk no BS with these guys. Yeah, there we go. Nobody likes these guys, folks. And I understand why, right? But like I always say, as a multi-species angler, the first time that you catch a species, you know, it's always unique. So, very, very happy with this guy today, you know. I'm pretty sure after I catch two or three of these, I'm gonna get tired pretty fast. But I just wanted to show you guys one more time, right? Let's be careful with this. Check this out, huh? This is no joke right here, man. Look at that, this is like a freaking teeth, man. And there's another one right here, all right? Seriously scary. All right, let's take a couple shots and release this guy. At least we got, we got our goal for the day accomplished. Be beautiful eyes, a little bit bloody, but he's gonna be just fine. Yeah, check that out, huh? A little bit this year. Okay, he's going, he's going. He's going, he's finding his way. Hopefully he's gonna be okay. If not, it's just one last dogfish in the world. Nah, he's fine. They're sturdy fish, man. So this has got to be a day full of coincidences, fellas. Because as I, as I was fishing down here on the jetty, right? One of my friends actually sent me a message. And he was like, I can see you. That you were down there, you know? And I thought when he meant that, he meant that he saw the Instagram photo or something. But no, the dude is actually right here. So check this out, huh, guys? It's gonna be like the biggest coincidence of all ages. Check who's here, huh? Good old Johnny Boy fishing, huh? Oh, what's up, guys? Yeah, dude, what are you doing right here, bro? I'm trying to catch some blackfish, tog. Yeah, trying to do some togging, huh? Yeah. This dude is like the tog master, nah, man. Nah, that's not me, nah. No, that's not you? Nah, that's not me. When was the last time you caught a tog? Oh, last fall. Oh, last fall? Yeah, this is my first time getting out for a tog. Gotcha. Yeah, but seriously, guys, if you guys don't know Johnny Boy fishing, make sure you go check his channel, you know? Dude does some amazing saltwater fishing in the New Jersey area. Definitely recommend it, you know. If you catch a dog today, we're gonna film it, all right? Sounds good, dude. Yeah, man, waiting for that 23 incher, man. So yeah, guys, action kind of slowed down over here. And look, if you guys look at the jetty right now, right? These are the moments that I'm really happy to be a multi-species angler. Be targeting all the dog fish and the skates right here because the dog area right there at the end, man. It is hot, all right? I don't know how many tog holes are at the end of this jetty right here, but haven't seen no tog landed yet. Ha, <laughs> you know, we will see. Oh yeah, take it easy, man, take it easy. Feel it. What do you feel? <laughs> oh, son. What what do you think it is? Your your guess. The same one. You think it's the same one? Well, okay, let's see. Let's see. Feels a little bit smaller, huh? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's another dogfish. I'm I'm actually feeling quite uh, quite happy now that the dogfish are all around. Check that out. Boom. Feisty little fella, man. Yeah, look at that, greedy. Man, greedy as hell. 
You think you need the pliers for this one? You got it? Oh yeah, you're using a big ass circle hook, my man. That's why I missed the last one. All right. At least this one didn't bleed like the last one, right? No. All right, let's see the troll of the century. Boom. And guys, you know, we are sorry we can release this fish a little bit better, you know, but you definitely don't want to risk yourself going on those rocks right there, especially the ones with the moss, you know? They are pretty sturdy fish. Hopefully they're going to be okay. All right. Let's keep fishing. Alrighty guys, it's about time to call it a day. I've been fishing down here with my brother-in-law for about three hours. It's 11 a.m. right now. We got here around 8 a.m. As I have mentioned many times in this video previously, when we just got down here at 8 a.m., right, that was like the prime time, you know? We were getting good bites, right? And then throughout the morning, <laughs> the bite kind of slowed down. Needless to say, we did accomplish our goal for today. I added one more species to my species list, right? The spiny dogfish, that was the species number 168. So, I mean, I can't really be sad, right? I came down here just to target those and actually got those. So, I'm actually very, very satisfied. I think this is gonna be the only saltwater video for this Atlantic City trip, unfortunately. I would love to be fishing more here and bring you guys more footage. However, this is a family trip, you know? You got the wife, man. You got the sister. You got the nephew, right? It, it is not easy to deal with everyone at the same time. However, we may, I may be bringing you guys one more video from freshwater fishing. We will see, okay? Thank you very much for watching today's video, guys. Tie lines and until next time. Fish on. Oh yeah, there we go. <laughs> Why is this bass seem to be so stunted though? The head is so big, but the body is so small.